Hi guys, welcome to this tutorial and in this tutorial we will take a look at some of the more methods of selecting data from databases. Here I have already connected to my MySQL terminal. Also I have created a new database. So I will just do here so databases. The new database I, which I have created is called music. So I will do use music. I have also created a table inside it so I'll just do so tables the table name is my music so we'll just take a look at the parameters present in my music describe my music so the table my music consists of six parameters the first field is id which is integer and it is also primary key and it is also set to auto increment which means it will automatically increase the second value is artist and it is a type of text the third parameter is album and it is also a type of text fourth is title it is also text and fifth is track so it will be a number like one two three four number of tracks and the last parameter is year it is also an integer so actually i have already populated the table my music with loads of data so i'll just show you the details of the table which i have created so i'll do select star from my music i'll just maximize it so that you can see it so here is our table my music it consists of 30 rows of 31 rows of data and here for value of id equals to 1 the artist is the beatles album is abbey road title is come together track is number 1 and year is 1916 similarly i have put in the data for 31 rows so suppose i want to select rows with track numbers 1 and 2 or 1 2 and 3 then I will do this command select star from my music which is my table name where track is in 1 and 2 since the value of track is an integer we don't have to use quotes while writing one or two if you use title in place of track then you will have to use quotes and inside the quotes the title whatever you want to display so i'll do enter here and the rows which contains track number as one and two will be displayed similarly we can do one two and three also so in this case the values which contain track number is 1, 2 and 3 will be displayed. So here you go. Now suppose in place of track I want to use title. So here I will change it this to title and here in place of 1, 2, 3 I will use quotes and inside quotes I will use wet this title has to be exactly matched then only the results will be displayed otherwise it will not be displayed remember that and second one is when I hit enter the rows which contains title as Mitchell and white will be displayed now suppose I do select star from my music where title in wet I'm looking through you. 
here remember that while you are searching for a particular title which contains an quote mark then you need to escape that code by using a backslash so here when I hit enter only the rows which contains title as I am looking through you and where it will be displayed now suppose in this table we want to select some random rows so we can do that by using the command select star from my music where one order by random we can limit the number of rows to suppose limit 10 here randomly 10 number of rows will be selected and displayed now we'll take a look at the original table select star from my music here as you can see the value of artist is the Beatles and Beatles and the value of album is Abbey Road and Rubber Soul so if we want to select some distant values of artist and album then we will use this command select distinct artist comma album from my music where one so here only the artist and album value will be selected and only the distant values will be displayed now we'll take a look at our last command for this tutorial which is how to display the maximum number of tracks here we have values of track suppose 1 2 3 4 and the maximum number is 17 suppose we want to display the maximum number of track in the table so we will use this command select max in bracket the parameter track from my music so it will display 17 so that's it for this tutorial guys thanks for watching and if you like this tutorial don't forget to subscribe